So a few days ago on Board Your Supply, I hosted a little giveaway, kind of last minute. I decided to throw in my steering wheel in a random person's order placed throughout last weekend. So that's exactly what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna pick a random number. I'm gonna throw it in like a generator on Google and whoever's pops up, I'm gonna just ship the steering wheel out with their order. These are the orders placed this weekend. So we're gonna start at 1290. The latest one is 1335. Random number generator I found on Google. So 1290, 1335. All right, who's it gonna be? All right, ready? 1307, let's see who it is. So shout out to you bro, Juan Quintero, number 1307. I'm actually gonna go ahead and call him. I think he can, he has a number here. I'm gonna call him. Hopefully he answers, that'd be pretty cool if he answers. Hello? Yo, is this one? Yes. What's up, dude? Hey, it's uh, Chris. Chris. Borges. Oh, yo. What's up, bro? How you doing? I'm doing good. Man. Good, good. Yeah, so I just uh, chose a random number for the carbon steering wheel giveaway, and yours was it. Yo. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, dude. So I'm going to go ahead and ship out. Once I take it off the car, I'll go ahead and ship it out to you. Alright, for sure, man. Yeah, Damn, man. Bro. Just Thanks, curious, man. do you have do you have an FRS or no? Um, I used to, but I recently got in a crash in December. Ah, uh, yeah. no way. I total, yeah, total lost it. No and way. Yeah, so I basically lost the whole thing, and. Damn, that's. I mean, I, I don't know what I would do sucks. with the thing, to be honest. Yeah, I was just so, about to say, bro. but hey, you can keep it for like memorabilia or something. Damn, bro, thank you so much, man. I keep doing a lot of. Good content, man. It's the best. You encouraged me to get a, a BRZ. Yeah, you did. Uh, Damn, no I just way, started dude. watching you a lot. But it means a lot, still. bro. All right, thank you, man. Have a good day. You as well. Thank you. Bye. -bye. There you go, man. Good man. I was hoping like whoever had it has an FRS, but that's still dope. He can still have it for like memorabilia, but huge shout out to him for winning the giveaway. So yeah, he was just saying that he crashed his car recently, which is so sad. That is so unfortunate, uh, but hopefully him winning this giveaway kind of cheered him up and made his day a little bit. So huge shout out to Juan again for winning the giveaway. If you guys haven't seen yet on Board Your Supply and on my Instagram, I did recently drop a new collection of t-shirts and hats as well. They're now live on the website. So if you guys are interested, I'll go ahead and leave the link down in the description below. It'll be the first link that'll take you straight to the website. But yeah, that's enough rambling guys. We got a new video today for the Mustang. We got a new part to install. So right here in this box, we have a brand new spoiler slash wicker bill for the Mustang. A lot of you guys have been commenting in the comment section below saying I need a duck bill for this car. I highly agree. It's definitely missing something on the trunk. The GT350 track style, track pack style spoiler. <laughs> I'm not sure what it's called. And to top it off, we have a ZL1 add-ons wicker bill to bolt up to the spoiler. Basically just going to give it that extra flare. It's going to stick up a lot. Definitely looks much better than just the spoiler itself. Ever since I saw this type of wicker bill on different Mustangs, I just knew I had to get it for my Mustang. It looks so sick, especially with the Euro tails, one of my most favorite mods for this car. I'm just super excited to see what it looks like. It's going to look so sick. It does come pre-painted. I believe you can choose any type of paint job you want. Pretty much to the OEM color of whatever your Mustang is. In my case, obviously the car is wrapped a sand color. So I just felt black would flow best with the sand color. It does come with some hardware along with some instructions. So huge shout out to Speed Form for that. First things first, before we mock it up, we have to remove pretty much the whole under panel of the trunk. Pretty much just a whole bunch of these clips. I'm gonna pop them off with the tool I have and um, these little rubber stoppers, whatever you want to call them. Screw these. Yeah, just unscrew these. Oh 
Oh shoot, it's a spider. <laughs> As you guys saw, we just took off the under panel for the trunk. That'll give us access to, I believe, screwing the bolts that go in the middle. And um, the two bolts that go on each side actually line up with the factory grommets, which is super cool. So there's one on each side. Step two, using the provided drill template, remove the center adhesive contact. Step four, we are gonna line it up on the trunk and we pretty much, I'll, I'll just show you guys when we do it. <laughs> it's kinda hard to explain. When we mock it up just like this, we pretty much tape these templates down. So when we take the spoiler off, these templates will still be there and the holes will be right there. So that's actually pretty cool. I never really thought about some type of template like that, but it actually works pretty perfect. Got it? All right, so you can see here, we have a perfect spot to drill through right here. That's pretty cool. I never really thought of something like this. Day two of the install. You guys saw in the previous clips, we got the track pack spoiler onto the Mustang now. Secured nice and tight, this thing is like literally going nowhere. Now we're not done yet completely with the install. Got a package from ZL1 add-ons. Now this is just a little extension, like a wicker bill. That bolts straight up to the spoiler. Do the side with... Oh. We are gonna be using some rivet nuts. They're just a good alternative versus using a nut and bolt, especially if you can't reach behind the spoiler to put a nut behind it. Uh, so these are super cool. All right, we got the center one mounted up. Since we have the center one in, we can pretty much just hold this up. Mark all these holes to drill out. Take that one off and then drill the rest of them. So aggressive. Oh damn. That looks so freaking good. Damn. Yeah, that made such a big difference. That looks so good. Dude, this view right here, that definitely made such a big difference in the rear end. Wicker builds are one of my favorites. Like it just looks so nice. Like how <laughs> look how huge it is. It extends so far. It literally looks like a freaking ramp. <laughs> like the angle is crazy. What do you think? You like it? it? Looks so nice. I had to get it from a different perspective, so we decided to take the car out. Get a little bit of rollers, and I want to see what it looks like driving. I'm so happy with how it came out. It looks so good. I think I've said that like a million times already. It just looks, oh my god, I love it so much. I'm just looking at it right now. down in the comment section below. Dude, I can't get over it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's like perfect. Yo, the combo, the wicker bill with the spoiler is perfect. Bro.
thinking about going full catless with a Mustang as well. What do you guys think? Just remove the cats, make it super loud. That's like, I've been thinking about it. Just parked the cars, about to play a little bit of ball. <laughs> we actually just got some baseball gloves like a few days ago. It's like the new thing. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm so hyped and I'm still super hyped with how the duckbill came out on the Mustang. Absolutely in love, I'm sure you guys can tell. I need to actually go get the thumbnail in a little bit. Um, I'm actually super excited to drive it so I can see it again um, and get some pictures at the gas station. But yeah, real quickly before I end off today's video, I wanna let you guys know that sometime in the future, I'm going to be making like a rating video of your guys' car builds. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave an email right here on the screen. Email me pictures of your build and we'll put it in the video of like rating all my subscribers' cars. I posted on Instagram asking you guys some video ideas of what you guys wanna see on the channel and that was pretty much like at the top. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys what you guys want. So if you're interested in having your build featured on that type of video, be sure to email me your pictures to the email I put on the screen right here. With that being said, I hope you guys all have a great one today. Make today a good one, make the best out of it, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace. So a few, day so a few days ago on a, oh my gosh, I can't talk anymore, I'm hungry. So a few days ago on Borgia Supply, I hosted a car, I hosted a giveaway on giving away, oh, I hosted. <laughs> you are the winner of the carbon steering bro you are the winner of the carbon fiber steering wheel i cannot talk right now look up oh. <laughs> zero non-existent oh. <laughs> looks really really cool and i it's actually way bigger Oh, I'm not gonna say that, it's just gonna sound wrong. Oh. Dude. No. Oh my gosh, I'm not doing that again.